I'm going to give you a set of words now and you have to identify which among these you feel unimpressive or you don't like those words. Love, courage, respect, rules, discipline, self-image, confidence. I'm sure those two words you have felt unimpressive. That is discipline and rules. Most of us don't like it. And when we think in our children's perspective, of course, they don't want to hear anything about rules and regulations. Now, disciplining our child or discipline is something I can say it's a long and vigilant process of guiding our children from the childhood until they reach adulthood. Our ultimate goal as parents is to make them get that responsibility or uh, make them a responsible person bringing into that maturity level to be in that society to enjoy good and forbid evil of course we all want our children to get that that decision making skill or that power to decide what is good for them and what is not right all of us want this and to get this outcome we need to have right communication at right times Sometimes we may need verbal communications and sometimes non-verbal. Sometimes the written instructions plays a vital role rather than giving them all verbal instructions. Sometimes our behavioral changes that we bring to correct ourselves can make our children model us. That's how discipline is all about. But what happens is unfortunately we as parents have associated punishments in such a way that child feels punishment is equal to discipline or punishment is directly associated with discipline. Using harsh words seems to be so hard for child to intake or introspect about himself. He feels that he is lying nowhere. His self-image is damaged because of those words and he feels that he should never have a disciplined life. He starts hating discipline. Most of us as parents, we have been overusing or misusing punishments and that's the reason children don't want to have this life of discipline. When I told you about those set of words like love, respect and courage, everybody likes those words, even children. When we talk about love, connection and respect, of course, everyone is seeking it and everybody wants that. Everybody is inclined towards all of them. Why? Because it is that which brings that coolness and calmness. It is not associated with fear. We have connected discipline with harsh words or punishment. So one thing what we have to do is we should make our children feel loved. Only then we can discipline them. Only then we can con correct them. Initially, when we connect, we are able to correct them. So we should be mindful in the way how we deal with our children to discipline. Of course, disciplining our children is mandatory. But how to discipline them, this matters a lot. The more the child is felt loved, easier it is to connect or easier it is to discipline that child so we have to initially take away all those harsh words because harsh words is nothing but bringing only fear anger bitterness and, and that resentfulness so we have to give that a space to discipline our child to make them feel that yes i love you and that's the reason we are having these set of rules and that is how we can create a responsible individual so let us be mindful about our approach in disciplining our children. When you show your unconditional love and then discipline your child, you will get to that real outcome or that desired outcome. Think about it. So before leaving, if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, do subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you get notified whenever any new insightful videos are uploaded on YouTube.